Hey guys, it's Ashlyn, and today I'll be making another braces video. Um, I will be giving you some of my advice about braces, and yeah, so if you want to know some of my advice, just keep on watching. Bye guys. Tip number one, get these. If your orthodontist doesn't already give you these, get them. They are so amazing with flossing and like help getting you, getting stuff out of your braces because food will get stuck in your braces. It just happens because like, Food, whenever you close your mouth and you're chewing, food is just all over. It goes all in your mouth. And so it's going to get in your braces. And this thing, can you see that? It looks like that. And you take this off and then that wisp gets the stuff like out of your bracket. And it really helps with like these, the little thingies. I don't know what they're called. Oh, hooks. Hooks. That's what they're called. And then this part helps getting in between your teeth a little bit. So that is tip number one. Get the number two. Okay, so this is more of like a thing to help you for, somebody asked a question. And this question said, like how often and how long do you have to brush? Um, I brush, um, I try to brush at least three times a day. And that's because I want to brush after breakfast, before I get on the bus or go to school or summer, you know, just after breakfast, um, after lunch, and, okay, this is another question, do you have to brush at school? Um, I honestly do not brush at school, but I do use the little wisp things that I just talked about, um, in tip number one, I do use those at school, but I normally just, like, bring, like, a little hand, like, you know, like, the powder mirrors, like, the packs, um, I normally just bring a handheld mirror, not like the big ones, but like a little one, where I can like see my teeth and just, you know, get this stuff. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, but also, for how long, I brush at least two minutes, um, and I use this little timer that my orthodontist gave me, it's two teeth, and so it times you for two minutes, or you can just use your phone and like listen to like two whole songs, or just one like listen to one whole song on Pandora or something and then you're good. So that's tip number two. Tip number three. So whenever you're drinking like Coke or stuff, it stains your teeth. If you just regularly drink oh, I'm on camera a little bit. If you just regularly drink it. So I like drinking through straws because they um you can put it like behind your teeth and then you can drink it. Um so I like drinking through straws because it's like it's like way easier and it helps like not stain your teeth. I mean it still will stain like your teeth a little bit, but it really like lowers like how much it stains your teeth. Your ordinary honest will probably give you this long list of stuff you can't eat. Excuse me. Um I will eat whatever I want to eat. This is what my list looks like. It says avoid sugary, crunchy, sticky, chewy, or hard foods that can break your braces. What? I eat sugary, crunchy, sticky, chewy, and hard foods. And I had my braces for over like three months now. And I know you're probably like, that's not that long. But still, like, I've eaten all of those things and nothing's happened. Um, and then down here at the bottom it says like, Eating ice, chewing on pencils, biting in apples, all that can break, like, make your brackets come loose. Um, I don't really do, like, for apples, I do with slices because I don't really like biting in apples. Anyway, so, I don't know. But, um, I, I chew on ice, but I don't bite pencils or pens. If you do, great. <laughs> um, but eat whatever you want. So, like, if you have your races for four stinking I'm not going to refrain from eating sugary or crunchy foods for four years. It's not going to happen. So eat whatever you want. And my fifth and final tip is, so you're going to have braces for a while. They're going to probably take up a little bit of your time. And just like, okay, so you're orthodontist. Whenever you first go, they'll give you a bag. And it will have stuff in it. And it will have like question answer things. Like, 
if you, if something happens, talk to your orthodontist about it. Like, don't worry about it. Like, your orthodontist obviously went to college and knows how to fix your braces. So, like, if you, like, like, ugh, if you bracket comes loose or your wire bends, don't wait to tell your orthodontist because that will affect your teeth. Like, say if my bracket came loose and I didn't go to the orthodontist for a like almost a month. I don't wait almost a month because it will take almost a month for that to fix. Like, like it won't just fix itself. It's gonna bring your tooth with it. Like, it's gonna affect the whole process. So if some, sorry, I have hiccups now. Hold on. Okay. okay, but don't wait to ask your orthodontist. If you have questions, like my orthodontist, when I first got my braces on, he called my mom and he, he's really nice. He was like, he was like, how's Ashlyn doing? Blah, 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 blah. How she's doing? Is, is her mouth okay and stuff? He's really nice and your orthodontist probably is too. Like your orthodontist might not have called you that same day and been like, hey, how's blah, 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 are they okay? and stuff like they might not have done that but still your orthodontist knows how to fix your teeth and if you mess it up just call them all right guys thank you guys so much for watching and i will be doing a braces q a coming up so just put your questions in the comments below give this video a thumbs up and i'll talk to you later bye guys